And we do have a bunch of top stories to get to today, including indoor dining reopening in Erie County. But first, we want to get to the story that's gotten a lot of attention. We now know the charges against a cheek to Waga man who was wanted by the FBI after he took part in storming the U.S. Capitol last Wednesday. Peter Harding made his first appearance before a judge today to on your side's Dave McKinley has the latest. Harding faces two misdemeanor counts and is being released from custody subject to conditions. Harding appeared virtually from the Niagara County Jail where he'd been held since last night wearing blue fatigue similar to these seen in this booking photo. He's charged with entering and remaining in a restricted part of the Capitol without lawful authority to do so with intent to disrupt the orderly conduct of government business. He's also charged with being part of a violent entry into the building. We also learned today that when federal agents arrived at his Chicawaga home yesterday morning, he was not there, having left the night before and was arrested yesterday afternoon at a friend's house. In court, his lawyers argued that because there is no allegation that Harding engaged in any violent behavior once inside the Capitol, that he did not flee the district and was cooperative with the FBI, there was no reason to consider him a danger or a flight risk and to hold him. The judge agreed, but did set conditions on Harding's release, including that he be subject to electronic monitoring, not only of his person, but also of his Internet use. He also can't travel outside of Western New York unless it's to Washington, D.C. That's where the complaint against him was filed, and that is where, for now, further court proceedings against him will be held. Dave McKinley, Channel 2 News.